Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Good morning. I went to Burlington because Holden and Weston need more underwear. Um, Holden's been pooping his pants more often and I know Weston is still in the midst of potty training and stuff like that. So if he makes an accident, you know. Um, but I don't feel like cleaning up uh, like a runny poopy underwear now if it's like a big ball I know this is TMI but if this is a big ball I can easily like tip it over and put it in the toilet but if it's squishy and mushy whatever I am not gonna wash that underwear I'm gonna get brand new underwear so I was looking around at Burlington to see if they had any underwears so all these underwears that I got are 98 cents so I thought that was pretty cool Got them these, Buzz Lightyear, got some Lego ones, a Lego head, and then kids need more toothpaste, so I got toothpaste for them, and I got two new dish towels because apparently we're always running out of dish towels, so, and it only cost me $15.93, that is not bad for these items so I gotta head over to Hayden stay here because he has a dentist appointment at 11 so I gotta pick him up and then I'm gonna take him to go get a haircut before I take him back to daycare um, it is so gloomy out it seems like it's gonna rain today sun's not even out it's very windy so that's what my plans are for today so now we're going to go to the dentist and then I'll take him back and I actually got an idea instead of giving going to a haircut place to get him a haircut to save money in the future I'm going to get a haircut uh, kit like uh, for the boys hairs and I'll just learn how to cut hair through YouTube or something because that is going to save me a lot of money because it's just so hard to take individual kids um, different days and stuff like that and that's just a lot of money especially with boys and their hair grows so fast so I figured you know what I'll just go and get some uh, order some clippers and shavers razors I'll just buy a kit you know a haircut kit and that would, I think that would work perfectly and that'll save me tons of money in the future and then I can give Easton his first haircut and we'll be all good to go. So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna order it from Amazon and order it and then hopefully it'll come by Saturday and then we'll do some, we'll do like a haircut day on Saturday or something like that. And I'll film it and stuff like that. And, my iPad and watch YouTube videos on how to uh, do haircuts for boys because it's gonna be a learning process for me that's for sure because doing it by myself with the razor and stuff yeah um, it's gonna take some practice so hopefully I won't mess it up but I'm gonna try not to and yeah and just follow the instructions on YouTube then <laughs> all right so Hayden got his teeth clean very good news. He does not have any cavities. That is so awesome, so blessed. Because I told the doctor how difficult it is to brush his teeth and they noticed because he is a very strong boy. He likes to keep his mouth closed. He is super strong. It, take, it took three people, me, to hold his hands and then a uh, tech that cleans the teeth and then the doctor. So to do the flossing and scraping the plaque and doing the toothbrush cleaning it takes like a village, man, because he's super strong. But good thing he has no cavities. So they gave me some tips maybe to do to open up his mouth, like use your finger and just you and go like that. Um, and just keep doing my best on cleaning his teeth as much as possible. And that's all I can do. You know so and then to be able to help out with the plaque um, as soon as he gets done eating 
like squirt some water in his mouth so that it swishes around in his mouth so that it does so that the puree doesn't like sit in his mouth and stuff and creates plaque that could kind of help him um with that so i'm really glad that they gave me more advice because it's just been a struggle for me so but i'm really glad that he has no cavities that that's a huge blessing to me very huge blessing all right so i arrived at my pain management and it's raining outside and i wait i don't know if i have an umbrella i think i do but so i'm gonna go inside and see why my top of my spine is like tingling it like goes on and off and it's really annoying like sometimes i'll be sitting in the car or just sitting in general and all of a sudden i feel like tingles on the top of my spine so i want to make sure that that's normal or is am i supposed to feel that with having spina bifida i don't even know so that's why i'm here for the pain management so i'll keep you guys in updates all right well i got back and um my pan management doctor is in surgery doing a patient so he is running behind schedule so I had to reschedule it for Monday at 8 25. I didn't want to do a virtual visit because I was I'm experiencing tingles and I wanted to, him to look at my top of my spine just to make sure you know nothing's going crazy because they do have like machines and stuff to look so I wasn't comfortable of doing a virtual. So I rather do in person just in case of something goes wrong. So I'm going to head home and relax for the rest of the day. Good morning guys. I am on my way to my work service award ceremony. I've been with my company for 10 years. It's almost going to be 11 years in July. Um, in order for you to attend, you have to finish your full 5 or your full 10, full 15 or 20 on and so forth and so on. So um, I missed my first one because I was in the midst of moving and stuff like that. So now I finally get to have the chance to attend my company's service award ceremony. So I am headed over there. I like feeling all dressed up and pretty. So if I'm overdressed, oh well. I just like to dress up. <laughs> so that's what I'm doing today. All right, so I just got done with my service awards. It was a whole lot of fun. I really, really enjoyed it. So can't wait for my next five year, for my 15 year, because that was a, a lot of fun. The food was great. That was really fun. I know I'm saying that a whole bunch, but that was really fun. So I'm just gonna head home and relax until I pick up the other kids later. Good job. Good job. Good afternoon, guys. So, it is Saturday, and I bought the stuff to do the boys' hair. So, in order to save money and taking the boys to get a haircut, I got the stuff for it, and I got them a little drape it's a spaceship isn't that the cutest little thing so i'm gonna start with winston since he's gonna need a nap so i'm gonna unbox this and then i'm gonna look on youtube to um for guidance on trimming the boys' hair all right so i got the razor we're gonna do a five and I'm gonna put this over. What's that? What's that? Hi, Joe. What now? Just, yeah. Can you help up there? Yeah. Alright, you ready? Got 
my comb and my brush. So here we go.
Okay, we are done with Hayden's hair. He did pretty good. He was throwing a fit, but it's okay. Say it's okay. Mommy tried. Still looks good, right? Still looks good? Okay. All right, I think I did a really good job with doing their hairs. I get a little bit messed up with Hayden's because he kept moving along, but it's not too noticeable, but... The others, I did a really good job for being my first time using uh, the razor and stuff. So I give myself a thumbs up for that. I just swept the floors, cleaned up my mess. So yeah. Don't know, don't know what else I'm going to do today. Even though it's 4.23 in the afternoon. Good morning, guys. It is Monday. April 15th. I can't believe I always took the trash out. Because I saw one person have their trash out this morning. And I'm like, wait a minute. Trash is Monday night to Tuesday. So. Ugh. The start of my Monday. Um, Weston has it. Uh, 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 after school's done, oh. can I have your iPad? Oh, maybe, I don't know if you're good. Um, what else? I have my pain management this morning. Hopefully the doctor's not running late. And then with some speech therapy, and then that's all I have today. And um, I work majority of this week. I think I'm gonna go on my walk. I haven't been on my walk in a while. Yeah, that's all I have for Monday. All right, so I went to the pain management uh, appointment and they were busy and the doctor was running um, behind schedule. So I had to reschedule again. And the most embarrassing thing is I got to the pain management and I noticed that I bled through my jeans. I am on my freaking period and I bled through my jeans. So I went to the bathroom and my whole thing uh, is uh, full and I had a panty liner on. I know TMI, if you don't wanna listen to it, then have the skip button. But uh, that was quite embarrassing. I had to take off my jeans and put soap and water until you don't see the blood. Yeah. So that was quite embarrassing. So I told them I couldn't wait any longer. So I went home and I changed. I grabbed my box that I had to ship out for Dancing with Chaos um, for my business. And then I went to go pick up Winston. Winston did really good at therapy. Um, he was talking a lot, but the only thing is was his little bit of his behavior, um, just being a typical two-year-old boy. So now I'm back home and I think I'm going to go swimming. So, yeah. I think uh, instead of going walking today, I think I'm just gonna go to the pool, relax and yeah. So, I'm definitely going to bring more tampons because I want to go swimming. Yes, I know it's TMI, but yeah, that is just life. The circle of life of motherhood and just being a female in general. <laughs> so, yeah. All right, so I'm at the pool and the water is super cold. So, I'm like debating if I should just go in or not, but... It is cold. I didn't realize how cold it would be. The sun's out and it's making it hot, but the water is still cold. <laughs> so I'm freezing. Good morning, guys. I am having my breakfast, my eggs and sausage. I dropped off all the kids. I have work today at 11.30. So I'm going to just eat my breakfast, go home, get changed, and I got to send out my package. Um, and yeah, so I'm going to end this vlog here. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and turn on those notification bells. And I'll see you guys in the next video. I'm going to enjoy my breakfast.
And yeah, have a great day.